Results 2016 coverage now. A familiar face in Central Florida tonight campaigning for a candidate for Senate. Yeah, Vice President Joe Biden in Orlando today on behalf of Democratic U.S. Senate candidate Patrick Murphy. News 6 reporter Kirsten O'Connor had the chance to meet the VP tonight and shows us why Biden is not supporting Alan Grayson. A surprise visit no one could have really expected right here inside Chef Eddie's restaurant in downtown Orlando. But Vice President Joe Biden wasn't shy about his message today, saying he doesn't make endorsements often, but this is clearly an exception. And it was an exception that was also symbolic slight, endorsing the Democratic Party leadership's candidate, Patrick Murphy, in the hometown of another Democratic candidate, Alan Grayson, for Marco Rubio's Senate seat. What do you think about Alan Grayson? Thank you, everybody. I, Al, Alan's a fine guy, but the reason, look, I don't often endorse. I have, in my whole career, I think I've only endorsed in the primary uh, three candidates. But it wasn't about Alan. It was about the caliber of this guy. This is a, this, this is a real deal. Vice President Biden describes Murphy as a Democratic candidate who can reach across the aisle and unite the Senate. I doubt you'll find a Republican who says something negative about me. They're my friends. We disagree. They're my friends. They're not enemies. And he has that ability, unless we start talking with one another again, unless we start, uh, unless you're able to compromise, uh, we, we can't lead this country without some consensus. With a doggy bag in hand, the vice president made his exit, but not without snapping a few photos with a crowd waiting outside. I'm about to send it to my wife right now and put it on Facebook. You know we're going to the top with this picture. In Orlando, Kirsten O'Connor, News 6.